God gathered here and throughout the world, we offer now our prayers for the church, the world, and all people in need. O oh God, preserve your church everywhere from practicing empty worship and discipleship. Stir up our will to act with mercy and compassion. Keep our bishops, pastors, teachers, and all who proclaim your good news strong and faith. Lord, in your mercy, provide all living things with sufficient food and clean water. Make us ever mindful of the farmers and laborers who supply us with food, and open our hands to share what we have received. Lord, in your mercy, awaken our nation to care for veterans and others who have experienced the stress and trauma of war or other military conflicts. Inspire us to promote the well-being of those who have put themselves in the service of others. And we pray especially for those who are currently in military service today, including from this congregation, Danny and Dalton Berger, Christopher Nick, Douglas Boyd, Austin Island, and Dylan Lowe. Lord, in your mercy. Yeah. Bend down, Lord, to meet those who are trampled upon and then forgotten. Make them seen and heard and visible to us. Greet them with mercy and give new life to those who feel overwhelmed or broken, especially by discrimination, grief, or illness. We pray this day for those on our prayers including Judith, Marilyn, Lewis, Helen, Amy, Leroy, Louisa, Joseph, and Charles and Diana. For John, Charles, Stacy, Betty, for Lynette, for Earl, for Arthur, for Linda, for Bo and Donna, Linda, Kim, Richard, Stacy, Leroy, David, and Chester. For our friends Beth, Michelle, Mitchell, Darren, Richard, Aaron, and Ellen, Michael, Clarence, and Gail, John, Lynn, Aaron, Mary, Drew, and Dolores, Michael, Paul, Barry, and Steve. For Dr. Rogers and Anthony, for David and Sharon, for Bill and Marcy and Kian and Judith, for Catherine and Jane. We pray for all of our homebound members as well. For Joyce and Ruth and Lois, for Yvonne and Florence and Terry, for Helen, June, and other Lord, in your mercy. Bless the ministries in our community that reach out to the unnoticed and neglected, the invisible in our midst, or just out of our sight. We especially ask for blessing on our Haitian friends and co workers. Give us all a common vision of justice that eliminates hunger, greed, and self-righteousness. Lord, in your mercy, yeah. bind us together as well with the saints of every time and place until we join them around your throne. Lord, in your mercy, yeah. and do indeed bless this prayer shawl that goes out to heaven. She begins her life in Christ, surrounded by her loving family, who have also made this prayer shawl. Let us now set before God all those who we know and love or wish to offer up who are sick, suffering, or grieving at this time. We may say their names silently in our hearts or aloud. Enfold all things in your compassion, O oh God. And bring us into your life through the faithfulness of Jesus Christ, our Savior and Lord. Amen. And now, please rise as you're able. Let us pray now the prayer that Jesus taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our prayer. Peace of 
Christ be with you all. And also with you. Share some sign of that peace with one another. Hug, a handshake, this tap.